I've never been responsible. I've never been at a stable. I've never been at a job, bro. The longest I've ever been to a job was a year. That's sad. A year, bro. A year. Every other job, I'm there for six months, eight months. I leave. I come back. What is that? Welcome back to the False Line Podcast here with episode 147. Seven. 147. We are Seven. three weeks away Seven. from episode 150. We Seven. don't know what the fuck we're doing yet. So oh, I already got that shit planned out. Oh, that's what Eric says. We had a guest planned out. If you noticed, we don't have a guest. Thanks to Eric. Um, he backed so, out. Through, so. through, through the personal real family issues. Though, don't, that's real disrespectful. Real. Like said, uh, yeah, yeah, I didn't appreciate Because he's really all. going through it right now, and you're just basically just put him on blast like that. I'm putting you on blast. Yeah, but you, I already told you why he can't be here today with us. Okay. You didn't even bother finding an alternate, so no big deal, I guess, right? There's no need for an alternate. Um, I'm going to start off by saying I appreciate the TikTok love. Um, I don't know how much you guys pay attention to the TikTok page. I know y'all don't really give a fuck, but um, TikTok's been popping off. I watch it all the time. TikTok's is, it's, it's good. The growth is good. I've liked every single video on there. I hate it because it's possible on my fucking, you know, when you, you? Try to go, no, when you try to go on the... Um, to look at your saved videos yeah. they're all on there and i can't find the funny ones that i actually trying to look for because i'm liking every mm -hmm. single video that's good i appreciate that dude the false line appreciates that yeah but we're, we're kind of trending a little bit you know the growth is real i think we're slowly going to progress over time i think definitely in six months we'll be at a couple thousand followers on tiktok and uh, hopefully we can reach at least a thousand on youtube do you think my heart will be healed in six months i don't think so at all mm -mm. good um we'll get there <laughs> we'll, get, we'll show you some attention. Can you put your shit on vibrate or Please. something? Please. That's very disrespectful to the, the false nine. What's funny? <laughs> What's funny, dude? We want to laugh. I want to laugh. Oh, nothing. Okay, so on today's episode, we are going to talk about uh, the backup plan. Is going to be talk about the NFL starting up, the season kickoff. I mean, the Cowboys played mm -hmm. last night. Uh, very good game. We're going to talk about Zach's life a little bit. We're going to talk about my oh. life. You know, what your life a little bit what you're going through I, well oh, maybe I, I guess maybe maybe i don't know um we'll don't talk care. about how these things are with each other with us sex yeah. going through a rough patch in his life right now i am but good thing you have real good friends to be there with you to mm -hmm. help you through it what'd, yeah. you, what'd you say like all, in all honesty yeah dude like do you are you appreciative of your friends mm, i mean you guys kind of don't y'all complain about hanging out with me but I wanted to say something so bad. Why don't you say it then? I can't because he's a fucking liar. I'm a liar? Yes. You're a fucking liar. You're a liar. Because we're the ones always making plans with you. No. All the time. I've been trying to hang out with y'all every day and y'all are like, dude, my girl won't let me. Or, Let's go bowling tonight after this. I don't want to do that. No, that's what I thought. See? Checkmate. Thank you. I'm going four. to the casino tomorrow. But we're going to the casino tomorrow. You're probably not going to go. I'm going to go. You're not going to go? I am going. I already asked my girl. She said, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Are you going to? And you, you know, know if, I had a, if I had a... <laughs> If I had a girlfriend that, and I had a friend that was like in a bad spot in his life, I would put my girl on the back burner and be like, hey, I got to attend to this. Mm, I just can't. I love yeah. my girl too much. I mean, I'm doing I mean, my I'm, best. I mean, I'm, I do my best to try to hang out with you more, you know? No, like you say I, what you need to say. I tell her to fucking, that you're, that you're, they going should understand. Right now. I just have to think about how it feels or how it would feel to be alone. Zach's single. For anybody who's watching it, <laughs> for everybody who's watching it, um, if y'all like Zach's personality and y'all think he's, look at the camera, when he's, and you like his personality, you like the way he looks and everything, man, hit him up. Hit him up. You never know what you might find. He's a car salesman. He's not as good as me. He's okay. He's pretty funny. Not as funny as me. Mm. Um, I worked in a busier restaurant. He worked at Cheddar's and didn't really make that much money. Mm. Uh, what else? Uh, he has two kids, two beautiful kids. Uh, we still don't know if they're his or not, bitch. Uh, <laughs> but definitely, so kind of get him out of the get him out of a dump. So any young, I don't even care about a girlfriend. I just like like want a friend. Damn, you want a girlfriend? We we we're here though. Yeah, you, you really don't even need a girlfriend. Sometimes, right now, bro. literally, I don't want a girlfriend. Yeah, you want you like don't. a friend that's a girl, yeah. right? Yeah, like that you could that I don't have to give attention to. But you have to like just to hang out. Is or that how or? your other relationships work? You had a girlfriend but don't really give him attention. Usually. Mm, nice. Do you just want to hang out with them or do you want to be like... Like just have company and talk to a girl. But not not date them or nothing. Or talk to them like that. That sounds like a relationship. No, I just want to have like a girl who gives me 
girl perspective. Like, so from a girl like a, perspective. Just a friend that's a girl. Yes. That's easy. Right? Yeah. I guess. Okay. Um, Anyways. So, Cowboys played yesterday. They did. Thank God they lost. I want to oh, hear barely. you. I know you're barely. a big fantasy football. You guys are both in fantasy football league. So I just started. I got a lot of points. I had some. I had like Gronkowski in my in mind. Dak Prescott. Uh, had a tight end for another tight end for the Buccaneers. I had a lot of points. Like I took off. Yeah. On points. Mm. Yeah. And me and Zach had bet on the football game because I really thought the Cowboys were gonna surprise everybody, which I think they did. And they I'm not did. a Cowboys fan like at all. Yeah. I, they, I was a, that was a one time like they're gonna surprise, but they only lost by a field goal. Imagine that to the two, two to points the, to actually. the last year Super Bowl champions. I I don't think this is my opinion. I don't think Tampa played as good. That's your opinion. That was somebody else's opinion. Mm-mm. Mm. That's my opinion. Oh, okay. I think uh, Tampa's offense was a little. I don't know. Or what do you think? I mean, they did score a touchdown. Brady went off. They did he score did. a touchdown within, get within two minutes. He sh- I thought they was gonna he get sacked. He threw two picks, but one of them was because. He was trying to do too much it before, the, off somebody, before right? the half. Well, he was trying to throw a deep ball at the oh, half. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Remember? Yeah. And was like, oh, well, if somebody catches it, it's cool. If somebody doesn't catch it, it's still cool because they're not going to score because yeah. the halftime was up. So he threw one interception, just he didn't really care. And then one bounced it. off somebody and yeah. he got it right. But yeah, we I, had, think I, I think I'm going to try out to be the kicker for the Cowboys. <laughs> I mean, you could at this point. Yeah, well, this they, point had, they had two picks and they had two fumbles, right? Mm-hmm. They had four turnovers. So yeah. Fred can never shut the fuck up. Well, I'm just saying I don't think I, – I don't know. But the co- Dak played an amazing game. He did good. C.D. CD Lamb. C.D. Lamb popped off. Amari did. Cooper did even better than him. I bet whoever has C.D. Lamb in their fantasy got hell of Amari Cooper did better. Mm, yeah, but nobody really likes him. I mean, I, mean, I think – I uh, love Amari Cooper. Why do you love – why do you think he's so good? Because he shined at the Raiders. Mm-hmm. He was like their guy, and then I was just glad when he left. I don't I've always just liked him. Oh. Him and Michael Crabtree, they were good together. You think who has better hands, CD or Amari? Amari Cooper. So then, do you think CD is better than him in anything? No. Really? Speed. That's it. Speed. Okay. Mm-hmm. I was like, I think CD is slightly better in some things. Yeah. Like for the deep ball, mm-hmm. CD right. Lamb can go get balls, but Amari Cooper can break tackles and shit a lot better. What do you he think about Antonio Brown? He's cold. I've always thought Antonio Brown was cold. He just needs the right environment. He around him. good. He's like really fucking good. He fucking shitted on uh, what's his name? I forgot his name. But that corner? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. But Antonio Brown went off though. I know. Was upset. You got Brady. That's Who do you have on your fantasy? Last night, all I had, well, I'm in six different fantasy leagues. I had Brady in one, and then I had Zeke in one. I think he didn't do shit. Zeke didn't do anything. Yeah. He got like six points. They were never giving him. They, they, they weren't giving the ball He went from getting like 20 touches a game a couple years ago to now 10. We got Dak. So they're not a run-heavy team anymore. They used to rely on yeah. Zeke. Now they rely on Dak. Mm-hmm. It's mm-hmm. cool, I guess. He'll he'll pick it up throughout the season, though. He's well, still got to get his. Who do you have on your fantasy? I just said it. He yeah. Before you, you he said, said Dak, his. Tom Brady, no, Gronk. Dak and Gronkowski. That's, That's it. it. Okay, do you like it? We'll wait till you're done reading your message. Whatever. My customer. Sorry, I was actually working hard today and sold a sold a car, two cars. Um, you are going on a. Uh, Tell me why I knew you were gonna say that. Two week vacation. Yeah. Tell me why. Well, I'm gonna talk about it because I think um. I'm happy for you, bro. Yeah, I'm sick. I need it. To spend time with my with my son, my my girlfriend. Mm-hmm. I've yeah. never took a vacation to be in there here. You work really hard. Mm-hmm. I'm working hard right now. Like I'm I, trying to get everybody to come buy a car. Everybody's like, damn, Eric's selling cars. Mm-hmm. Bitch, like who? Who's saying that shit? I mean, L- everybody. Yeah, King. Is that what he said? LB, Randall. Is that what King said, bro? He yeah. was like, how does he sell so many cars? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, bro, just all referrals, bro. Basically, yeah. Well, today was a friend. He, was, he came in because he knew. I've been trying to get him to buy a car, and I fu- he finally came in today. Bought a car. But, yeah, how do you feel? Thing? How do you feel? I feel good. I'm leaving the boy right now. Uh, eight? Huh? Not, seven. Seven? Mm-hmm. Two. How do you? I, need, I need one more to hit my fast start, so that's a bonus mm-hmm. right there. And then uh, I'm going to try to hit 10 when I come back. Oh, well. I'm going to try to hit 10 by Monday because by the time I come back, it's not already going to be the end of the month. How do you um, how do you feel about taking vacation though? Like well needed. I feel like I'm still gonna get a little bit stressed because I know I'm gonna have customers that want to come in when I'm not there. What kind of do you have any plans for your vacation? Yeah, wanna, we're gonna go to uh, Houston, spend time with my sister, and just go out and do a whole bunch. You can of go stuff. to SeaWorld if you want to have members membership pl- uh, season pass that I won't get to use. So <laughs> why do you sound so sad saying that? Because I 
spend money on the season pass that I'm not going to get to use anymore. I bought it for my family. Oh. Yeah, his family got taken away from him. How? So, uh, what? He can just use it? He doesn't need a name change? Yeah, I just give him my pass. Really? I'm mm-hmm. pretty sure I can. You didn't, they take a picture or something. When they scan it, your picture pops up. Your little ass picture pops up. Well, I know for Six Flags, you, you could like let people borrow your season pass. I did Top that. Golf, too. For real? Mm-hmm. Oh, talking about Top Golf, you said that there's a league. There is. How does that work? It's like, like points? Yeah. It's like hitting the colors. Like we play every week except yeah, we're playing the other fucking suck. Bro, I've gotten better. I have it, but I don't care. We how should do it? it. $70 a week per team. Oh, per team? So how many people per team? Five, four to six. How do you like, how does the league work? Is it just one day thing? or Monday, every Monday. Seven yeah. to nine. And then what? That's it. But you have to pay $70? A week, yeah. To did stay they, in they, the league? Did they just start it or what? Yeah, it's starting soon. Like oh. the end of the month. So We should try it. We should I'm do down. It. It'll be fun. But well, okay. well, we need another person. Robert. Yeah. And it'll be yeah. like Robert Monday, we'll Monday night He's football. I have a question. So you do... I'm kind of confused, bro. I'm Every sure, Monday... I'm sure Zach doesn't know the fucking rules, dude. It hasn't even started yet. Why are you so fucking mean to me? God. I'm not. Okay, Monday, $70 a week. Yeah. But per team, though. Per team. Mm-hmm. And then I'm assuming just the team with the most points or what? Yeah. Probably. And then you go to playoffs and you win stuff. I don't know. That Dude. sounds fun. It is. It does. If you're good. I wonder. <laughs> I bet there's... What'd you say? It sounds fun if you're good. I am good now. Mm, yeah, right. I mean... Yeah. I kind of just swing kind of goofy, but... Sorry, sometimes I choke. You know, I go 10 swings and don't hit nothing. Mm-hmm. I go 5 and When I, you're up 30 points. Yeah. It sucks. Um, I choke it in cornhole. It's okay. <laughs> <sighs> I wish I had a cornhole league. I would kill in that league. I would kill in that league. You got lucky. Bitch, I, I beat you every single you. time. And I told Alvaro I was going to let you win, so. He said that because they already knew he was going to lose. <laughs> I, stopped, I really stopped trying to bring in because I didn't want you to pay me $300, so. You scared? No. Get away. I was already up. Because you would beat Alvaro. You don't care huh? about his money? But he's only $50. Yeah, took, no, you took $200 from me, bro. Yeah, but it's because you, you still think you're better than me at shit when you're not. I'm the king of cornhole, so I don't care. Not. I'm undefeated. Never lost. I can beat you if I wanted to. <laughs> I'll leave the podcast right now to go play with you. Come then. on! Come on. I got cornhole in the garage. Oh, that's my cornhole, right? We we went half on it. Oh, yeah, we did, right? And let's go play that game before we leave. No. No. That volleyball game. Mm-hmm. No. That's just... We haven't even played it well, yet. Well, don't even say it's fun because we've never played it. I was saying, we yeah. didn't even fucking play it. Okay. That was a waste of fucking money. It was. Mm-hmm. Um, you didn't even buy it, though, but whatever. And we went half on it. Hmm? Yeah. I was like, you didn't fucking buy it, so shut up. I'm gonna drink some of my water with it. Yeah, me too. That's good. Yeah, me too. I'm running out of thirsty, though. I'm gonna give me some drink. I'm gonna black. Nine minutes left. Are you kidding me right now? Did he just get up and leave? Yeah, he did. Um. I move out in one fucking week, bro. Ooh, you do. You are about to move out. In exactly a week from now. That, bro. That's good. That's big. I remember, bro. I will never remember the conversation we had. You will never remember the conversation we had? I will remember, always remember the conversation we had. What conversation? I don't know. I think we were coming from George's, and I was like, bro, like, I feel like I need something different in my life. I need to change. Like, anymore. You're like, bro, you got to move out because, like, right now, you don't, you're not motivated. To, this is what you said. I remember. I just won't ever forget, bro. You said, bro, if you don't sell a car, you just, like, you go home to your parents' house, and, like, nothing happens. Like, if you put yourself in a situation where you got to pay rent, you're going to come to work. I got to fucking make money. I got to pay my rent. I got to do so-and-so. And ever, bro, ever since then, like, that really helped me a lot, bro. Good. And I was like, damn, like, this dude's right. Damn. And then I remember I was so scared, bro, when I got approved and everything. I was like, man, I'm scared to this commitment. I'm scared to this. I'm scared. I was just scared, bro. Because, bro, I've never really had anything, like. I've never been responsible. I've never been at a stable job. I've never been at a job, bro. The longest I've ever been to a job was a year. That's sad. A year, bro. A year. Every other job, I'm there for six months, eight months. I leave. I come back. What is that? Tea? Yeah. Yeah, I tried to go to the grocery store last week, and you guys completely ignored my request. Yeah, bro, his fridge is empty. I know. And there's pizza that's old as fuck in there. No, I just got that pizza yesterday. The uh, old Chicago Oh, can we talk about you moving into your apartment? We that's were just talking, was just talking about, about that. For real? How do you feel? I'm excited, bro. 
You gotta move into your first apartment, bro. I know. I'm. I'm excited. I feel good. I wish I can go just to my apartment now. Just lay there and, and like I would just literally sit in the couch and smile. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, cause I'm like, damn, bro, I did this shit. I did this shit, bro. You did, bro. It's crazy. Life changing, bro. That's good. You, did, just, you got a couch already? I don't. Know. <laughs> he don't have the couch. Oh, yet, I'll bro. buy it from you. Fuck you. Before he gets it. Come on. Come on. You know, when I moved to Chicago, I was sleeping in the couch. You know, when I came here from El Paso, I was living in the garage. Damn, I don't even want to tell my story no mm, more. That's what I thought. Shut <laughs> up. Yeah. I was We're trying to make the, the audience feel sorry for you because no, you I had a good life. I'm not, I don't want to feel them feel sorry. I want them to know that, like, you can fucking do it. Oh, I also have great news that you guys are probably going to be like, oh, you're fucking bullshitting, but I'll get to it in a minute. Anyways, I used to sleep you're in the couch. You're having a baby. No. <laughs> um... I was sleeping in the couch and I was like, I remember I would just sleeping in the couch or on the couch. On the couch. Okay. Mm-hmm. I was sleeping there and I was like, man, like, I'm gonna sleep on this couch, whatever. I really ha- one day want to have my own place. And then I still will never. F- I remember I told Zach the conversation we had one time going. Even George is going to work. And I remember the conversation that we had when I was on lunch, bro. I called you or we were on the phone, and I was telling you, hey, bro, I'm about to move back to. Uh, I remember that. The to Texas. Yeah. And we were really talking about it. I just seen you post it. I think you had recently just got salesman of the month that time. And I seen that post. And I was like, damn, like, I'm I'm finna sell furniture. So like, I guess I can sell cars. Mm-hmm. Then I called him. We were on the phone for like 15, 20 minutes. And I was like, what? Oh, I got Bortillo's, I remember. Um, and I, we were just talking. He's like, yeah, bro, it's, it's good. It, it's life changing. And um, you didn't really hype it up that much. Um, because he was still new. Yeah. And because yeah. I, I know how you are. I know, I know how you don't like to keep jobs yeah. more than six months. So. Yeah. And then um, I was like, bet, like, my dude Eric, he going to put me on, whatever. And then I remember when I walked into the dealership, and I was, like, kind of nervous. I was like, damn, mm-hmm. I want to work here. Like, everybody's wearing a tie. I hear the phones ringing. It looks professional. You know, it's, like, intimidating. Mm-hmm. And then it's not that intimidating anymore. Yeah. But you know what well, you know, somebody told me? They were like, why would you get your friend to work here? Who told you that? I'm not going to tell you that. Damn. You like, why would you get your friend here? And I was like, uh... Cause did you start before uh, Robert or after? Right after Robert. Right after Robert, cause I had got Robert on. Uh-huh. And he told me the same thing. Why Damn. would you get your friend here? And then when you started working, you're like, another friend? Why would you do that? Uh-huh. That's more people that y'all both know the exact same people. And what if they go to him or whatever? Uh-huh. You know? Oh. And I was like, Damn, you right? Should I tell him not to work here no more? <laughs> <laughs> kind of thing. But I was like, Nah, you not that. I'm more cooler than you, so they'll probably come to me anyways. So. More cooler. Yeah. Hopefully, you have better grammar. I don't. I you know. don't. <laughs> he um. usually says much cooler. But bro, uh, ever since I started, uh, ever since I came, ever since last year, leaving the sh- going to Chicago, coming back, and then, uh, you know, working at the job at the dealership with Eric, with you, it's been life changing, bro. And then I got a new car, mm-hmm. I'm moving into an apartment. Mm. Got like, a girlfriend now. I got, but my life changed. Baby on the way. No, mm-hmm. no baby on the way. But that's crazy, bro. Um, but yeah, life is good, and it's only get better. That's good. And I look up to both of you guys, and it makes me so sad to see Zach like this. It does. It does. It, ma- it makes me feel sad, bro, because we're fucking close. Thanks. Like, I think we're fucking, like, good friends. I mean, I think that. I don't know if you think that, because you like to fucking have people who yeah, take, who steal money from you I get as your friends or whatever. Just, like, you go to lunch, and I don't know. I get mixed emotions. Mm-hmm. Bitch, shut the fuck up. goes to lunch by himself or takes other people, and, you know, it just it don't make sense, but... We want you to get out of your dumb, dude. So we, we, I mean, we we're actually we're gonna surprise you today. Yeah, we have a surprise for you. Um, we wanna, well, Alvaro does. He Vacation. Wants to pay for your vacation to go to Las Vegas, dude. Oh, he's gonna <laughs> pay for everything. <laughs> this uh, is great. Round trip. All you have to pay for is your plane ticket. Nice. Anything else, he'll pay Perfect. for it. Thank Hotel, you, Hotel, food, you. expensive, anything, he'll pay for you, man. Thank it was you. a surprise. I wasn't gonna go in on it, but I didn't want to take all the <laughs> yeah. The he's shine no, he's from from Alvaro. So bro, I appreciate it. I I'd rather just play the flight and you pay the rest. <laughs> we should really send his ass to Vegas or something. No. No. Why the fuck by would myself? you do that? Why the fuck would you do that by himself? He's fucking depressed. He's gonna spend all his money. He's taking him to the casino. But he's gonna follow my lead this time. And we're gonna come out millionaires. I promise you I'll win at least five grand tomorrow. You're gonna make me wanna go, bitch. Come on. Then go. Can you please come with us? Do you want me to go? Yes. Are we going to have fun? Yes. Yeah, if you make it fun, don't you, fucking... I don't want you to be sad, though. I'm going to get my mind off of it. 
We yeah. gonna from the moment we leave today we're gonna be lit. Lit. Uh, no, time. because you're gonna fall asleep. No, like we're gonna be lit. We're gonna have a good time. You're gonna go fall asleep in the car again. No, I'm with. not. I promise you. I'm gonna have a good time. Mm. I'm doubt I'm doubt it. I swear. Mm-mm. Well you gotta ask your girl first. No, I don't have to ask my girl. He basically just say he does what he, he does what he wants. You need to ask your girl. I, I'm gonna let her it's, know. It's but respectful hey, if you ask her. I'm gonna be like, hey, babe, I, I'm gonna go to I'm gonna so you, casino you, with you, the boys. You trying to say you check her? No, I don't say that. That's basically what you just said, though. No, so that's why I how inter- how I interpret it. <laughs> yeah, I think we should go though. I mean, I'm going for sure, but Shelby's going. I'm going. Okay. Honey's going. going. Honey's going. Oh, honey's going. Mm-hmm. He's cool. driving his bike though. What? All the way to Oklahoma? Mm-hmm. All the way to Oklahoma? Mm-hmm. He's crazy. It was taking like four days to get there. <laughs> yeah. On his bicycle? Yeah. Like, motorcycle. No. Bi- no. Bike? No bike. Shut the fuck he up. He would have said motorcycle. He said on his bike. He said on his bike. Meaning his motorcycle. But mm-hmm. if he meant motorcycle, he would have said yeah, bike he motorcycle. Said, yeah. Or he would have at least said he would have bicycle. Said, or he would have said engine powered cycle. But he didn't. But he didn't. He, he said, said foot powered bike. Yeah. That's <laughs> that's not what he said. That's what he said. Uh, so we can all probably fit in your car. Yeah. You crack that windshield. Right. So appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah. You know, I was watching the game yesterday. I have like a fire stick, and uh, the way I watch TV, like you watch t- local channels, but from from different states and cities. So the city that I was at, or state, I don't even know if it's a city or state. It's a uh, Cincinnati. Mm-hmm. You made fun of me because I thought it was Connecticut the other day. Bro, this is, oh Ohio. my God, bro. He said, I thought he it was said, Connecticut I think, versus Cincinnati. I think, the, I think Connecticut's going to bring, beat, uh, who are they playing? In? I don't know. Who's Cincinnati playing? Uh, I'm sorry, team. Is this I don't remember. He said, I think Connecticut's going to get it. And I looked at him and I said, not to Ronald, hey, uh, who does Connecticut, Connecticut <laughs> have on that team? <laughs> he said, what are you talking about? He said, well, that's what he just said. Yeah, I got Cincinnati like and Connecticut. Idiot. I'm dyslexic as fuck. And he wants to bet that the freaking Falcons are going to lose. He thinks, chi- I, he thinks Chicago's gonna not lose. Yeah, I said Chicago's gonna win. I know. I think the same against thing. the Rams. Yes. How much did we bet on that? Fifty. Yeah. You wanna bet too? No. You don't, need, you don't need to take no more of my money. Cause you, cause th- that's how you just said. You know that the, the Rams are gonna no, win. No, you just be taking my money, bro. Because you know the Rams are gonna win. No more. Because you know the Rams that are gonna win. Fair no more, the Rams bro. got a new quarterback. Bro. Because you know the it's Rams gonna, are Stanford, gonna win. Right? Hmm? Stanford. Mm-hmm. Stafford. Stafford. I think he's going to take some time. I think Zach said he'll back you on that bet. Stanford. So if you Stanford. lose, you only got to pay for half. No. But if you win, you got to give me half. Okay. For real? Yeah. Give me money. It's $25. 75 Bet. Um, Y'all going to be sad. Anyways, I was watching the this channel, Cincinnati, whatever. Um, They were starting to mandate the vaccine the vaccine for people that are like 18 or older no way they're like in the school i don't know what town it was at oh just like for school for, to go to school mm-hmm. oh or it was 13 i don't know what the age was but at a certain age you have to it was mandated in cincinnati what the fuck why that's fucked up right that is once you start mandating mandating shit especially something serious like that that's when shit gets crazy mm-hmm and um that's crazy for real yeah bro but that's only only just to go to school though right yeah well biden's trying to get it to where if you if an employer has over 100 employees they have to mandate it i thought that already passed yesterday did it Mm -hmm. well they either have to mandate it or get weekly testing yeah bro i think we have over 100 100 employees don't we yeah we do so do we have over 100 i don't think we have over 100 we do no, nah, there's no way. But nah. if it gets technical, then it, it might be between like her the building. Shop for the business or... It's the whole dealership. No, nah, there's like, there's 20 foremen, 20 salesmen, that's 40. There's like 10 managers, that's 50. No, nah, we're, we're, we're way probably under. right under 100 then. No way, we're probably like at 70 max, maybe. Mm. Mm, but... There's no way. I mean, yeah, look at our parking lot. It's not 100 paces. Yeah. 100 paces? Spaces. Mm. Mm-hmm. Anyways, but yeah, they're starting to mandate it. Uh, that thing with people with businesses that over a hundred people, it's supposedly it's the mat. I mean the vaccine. I don't know, but they're starting to do that shit. It's crazy. It's fucked up. I hope they don't do it here. Cause my son wants to. Well, my son goes to school and shit. Uh, when he starts going to school, by that time, it's literally five years. Yeah, but what if like it's mandatory later on? It, oh, it's school. It might be mandatory for schools. Mm-hmm. But I mean, at that point, they might have a better vaccine. Still not gonna get it. If it's mandated. 
still not gonna get it, bro. Like if you go to if you go to college, it's mandated to go to school. I'm not. I'm already graduated. So I don't need it. But I'm saying like for college, there's certain vaccines that you have to get. You right might want college. But if you would have went to college. But he didn't. But if, and in five years from now, I'm gonna be, 27. Okay. So I'm gonna wait too old for college. You're what? You probably still go to college because. You barely pass high school. Mm-hmm. I barely did pass high school. I know you did. Mm-hmm. Barely. Didn't you barely graduate too? Yeah, but that's because I was bad, not because I was stupid. <laughs> I wasn't because I was stupid either. <laughs> I didn't show up to school. No, you were fucking. You're like. No. A, you're like a bag of rocks. No, dude. I didn't show up to school. Mm-hmm. Mm. That's it. This podcast was pretty fucking whack. It was alright. I think it was alright. Yeah. I think it was terrible. We basically just covered a couple points. Vaccine bad. Football uh, good. Football huh? good. Football good. All very stupid. Zach Life Suck. Yeah. Eric Fat. <laughs> there we go. Pretty good. Pretty good uh, well, points. We need, we need like three more minutes mm. to no. go the time. I want to see a 30 on the video when I post it. Um, yeah, well, we're at 29.34, so. Yeah, but we talked for like a long time. Mm? We were fucking around for like three minutes. We got to think of a guest. You have to think of a guest because mm. apparently it's your problem. And we're going to record this Monday. No, we're not. No, we're, we can't. We can't. Why? We're with Angel Monday. Yeah. Stupid oh, fuck. fuck. Oh, that's it. We can talk about that. Yeah, stupid fuck. Oh, yeah. Uh, for y'all watch it, we're going to be on a radio station. It's a... Uh, I forgot what the station was. Damn, 107.4 or 10, right? 107.4 or 104.1. Tejano hits, though. Yeah, like Tejano that. something. We're going to be on it. We're going to be talking a little bit about ourselves and our podcast and what we're doing and what we're trying to accomplish. And maybe listen to some good music. Maybe so we can see how Zach dance. And it's PG. Yeah, and it... Oh, oh it's yeah, PG. we can. Right. It's going to be hard, yeah, bro. Yeah, it is going to yeah. be hard. I'm going to be like... What? <laughs> Did you hear that? Yeah, I heard it. Yeah, we cut that shit out. Nah, Man, we can't say nothing. Yeah, I feel like you're gonna fuck up. Who? You? Nah, I'm not gonna talk. Nah, I'm just not gonna show up. <laughs> you excited to be on the radio? It's alright. I mean, I'm not Hispanic, so it's. I mean, I've been on the radio before. I mean, I got my own commercial, so. Yeah, I me. Mean, I've been on TV too, no problem. Yeah, but you took you 45 minutes to actually get three words. Yeah. He had forgot one word for about 45 minutes. You know, it was the first word of the whole thing. He could not remember. It that. was like mid. It was the, literally paragraph. the first word. Okay, the first sentence, something. It was, uh, yeah. It was like, and it was like four words in the sentence. It was real easy. I'm and sure. He it couldn't was. remember. And he couldn't. It was probably like, "Hey, my name's Alvaro." Something no, like that. bitch, no. It was just something like, "Come on, Alan, Sam, and check out our deals," but in Spanish. He couldn't remember it. No, it like was that. like we had the something something event. Come check out this vehicle. Yeah. Like, we yeah, had the summer sales event. Vehicles. No. I don't it's like crazy. doing commercials. Y'all are mean. No, you just... Oh, mean. <laughs> Man. You guys think I could be an actor one day? No. no. Absolutely Ever. not. Oh, well, yeah, you're right. I wouldn't remember the script. <laughs> At all. So I would have to be like uh, like freelance, you know, like just play it out, whatever. What is it called? Uh, improv? Improv. There you go. You would never make it as an actor. You wouldn't. Ever. Please do not even get that dream in your head because it will not work. Please. Ever. You, I'm barely even letting you be a car salesman. Barely. And this podcast, I mean, that's... Mm-mm. You can't be an actor. Should I just retire? Probably. That would probably be best. Yeah, well, that's not fuck. I'm not fucking leaving. You know where that's from? Oh, uh, Wolf Wall Street? Yeah. Cool. Um, I have something else that's exciting, guys. What? Is that what you want to tell us? Yeah. So, uh, Eric knows about this. He's seen me post a lot last year about digital marketing, social media marketing, whatever. So, I have a friend. You, you probably know Diego, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, that, is that when you were on the phone with him when you said you were going to talk to him on the phone for a little bit or whatever? So, we finally agreed on something and it's taking place. So, so you agree, is it t- does it have something to do with the podcast? No. Okay, I was gonna say because I know you didn't just do anything without information. No, no, I, I'm just yeah. doing like the digital. I'm just doing like social media for him again. Well, not, not again, because we were doing it. You want to want him to ruin your life again? No. He's gonna make you move, and then you're I'm gonna not just, moving though. Yeah, but he's gonna somehow convince you, and you're gonna fucking go. No, he actually donated like a lot of money for the equipment, so put some respect on his name. I know he did. I'm just kidding. kidding. Fucking disrespect. Anyways, yeah, so um, run. I'm gonna run some ads for him, and you know, start, start his business again. and shit, mm-hmm. and it's gonna be good. I'm happy. Well, and it, it just came to me. Uh, you know, I didn't really like talk. He just called me like, "Bro, I need you to do this and that." And I was like, "I got you." And then I made a little sheet for him. What I was gonna do and how much it was gonna cost. And we like, bet, bet. Better be good. Better be good. Like if it's not good, well, it's gonna be just Google ads. So, you know. so that's all you're gonna do for your friend? 
Just Google ads. Google ads. Uh, make content for them. You know, on the what is Google ad? Google ads what? Google ads. What? Now you can only see it whenever people are on Google. So like if you need a roofer, you type in right now. Even if you take a hamburger near me on Google, it'll show you an ad. Mm. So the first thing is, and it has a little AD. That's what I'm going to do for him. Anthony Davis? No. Like, ad. Ad. Anthony Thompson? No. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Anthony Avis? No, dude. Jake Paul? Ashton Darton? Pake Jaw? Dak Prescott? Pat Descott? Dak mm-hmm. Descott? Mm-mm. How do you ruin it? Like, we're having so much fun and you ruin it. Elite Music? What? Huh? What did you just say? I don't know. I don't even want to talk anymore. You're, we're not just saying his name backwards. Oh. He just said. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what he said. It's so I said so Elliot Zeke. Oh, my gosh, bro. <laughs> like Rob Ronkowski? Or Bames John? <laughs> That's a good one. The name's Bames. 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 Or the name's John. Say it like the Bames whole. John. Yeah, like that. <laughs> <laughs> uh, this is. Well, that's it for this podcast. Literally, mm-hmm. terrible. We kind of, uh, kind of just. This is what happens when Eric it. fucking schedules it. I guess canceled on us. I had no control over that. I hope you have a guest ready for next week. I already got him. He's already lined up. He's already ready to go. Approved. Yeah. I was waiting for what day we're going to record. P- approved, ready to go. He signed up already. We just need delivery. We really kind of got to really, re- we probably got to record on Monday. Why? Because I leave Tuesday. Where do you leave? It's my vacation. You're not going anywhere. I am. I'm not going to be You're going to leave I'm, right away? I'm leaving Tuesday, yeah. Oh, my. Oh, Wednesday. I'm leaving Wednesday. Yeah, I'll leave Wednesday. Well, we might be able to take a week off. Maybe I gotta look at the calendar. Oh, we got it. We're taking a week off. Yeah. yeah. So yeah. next week, guys, we actually won't be posting. We won't the video. actually won't be doing a podcast next week. Uh, uh, you heard it here first. So, <laughs> one forty-seven. Uh, thanks for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Um, False Nine Podcast on all platforms. Yes. Um, we're gonna Apple, have better. We're gonna have better contact with it when we have a guest. Apple Podcasts, Spotify, YouTube. Show that TikTok love, please, please, please. TikTok is our best friend right now. Um, make sure you share. Probably don't share. No, I fuck it. Share this podcast. Share the whole channel. Uh, comment. Do what you gotta do, mm-hmm. uh, guys. The false nine. Once we have a bigger following, you guys are both on your fucking phones. I don't give a fuck. That's fucked up, bro. Damn, but that was a year ago. Um, uh, that's the end of the episode one forty-seven. Peace out. Peace.